What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Folks, there will be a Friday evening hangout, and it'll be 4 p.m. Eastern time. If you're new to the channel, join us. I think you'll enjoy it. We have a great bunch of people on there, and it's always a fun time. We can talk about everything from A to Z, pretty much. Uh, most of it's gotten to do with space or uh, any theories or any of that sort. So uh, if you're new to the channel, join us. I think you'll enjoy it. Anyway, folks, I was perusing through a couple of these Facebook pages, and there is one page on there, and I'll show it to you in a moment, that had this particular picture. Now, I didn't get an official NASA link to it, but that doesn't matter. Uh, when you see the photo, you'll see it's definitely uh, comes from NASA JPL, right? Now, when you look at the landscape, first look, rocks. Nothing but rocks on a hillside, right? Let's take a closer look and see if that's really just rocks, shall we? All right, here's the page right here. You can see it's planetary landscapes, and the description says, new images of Jezero, or Jezero Crater, Delta as our Perseverance rover is making her way through an absolutely stunning landscape. This image was captured on July 23rd, so that's what, seven, roughly seven days ago, with the right nav cam. Credit image, NASA JPL Caltech. Image processing, Jason Major. Now, they do process it to make it look like garbage as far as I'm concerned. However, when I do look at that, it is definitely something you see from NASA JPL, okay? So they do process the image, and of course, not in a good way as far as I'm concerned. Now, you would agree, you look at this photo, and I see nothing but rocks. Until we get really, really into this photo, I start to take a look around, okay? And there's some real interesting features on this hillside. Let's just jump out of this and go right into Photoshop, and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. All right, here it is right here. Now, folks, just looking at this here, kind of looks like rocks, and you, you would probably agree with that. I saw this item right here where it has this cross piece going like this and going across, and it looks like some kind of, almost looks like part of a wall, but I'm not so sure that's what it is. I think it's a manipulation to hide whatever is actually here, right? This right here, what's going on in this whole area? Because I see what looks like parts weird shaped objects that look ornate, right? This right here. You can see this thing has an angle, goes up like this and goes across, and it looks like it has a darker line inside that. Is that it right there? And it also has some other weird little features right here, and I'm gonna show you that in a second, because we're gonna jump right into the fully enhanced photo. This object is what caught my eye. I'll put it right in the middle of the screen. You can see this. And you can see this pretty darn good right here. What are we looking at there, folks? I mean, check this out. Like I said, I'm going to bring out the details a little bit better. And we're going to get rid of this crappy color. Take note of this right here. You can see something right in the bottom here. And you can also see a piece of that is white. See that right there? Okay. Go over to the left. What is going on with this object or multiple objects? This as well. Notice all of these little rectangular areas going right across like this here, okay? Let's just go step by step and enhance this, shall we? I did some enhancement. One was auto and the other one was manual, okay? There's one and there's the other. Let's just keep going with it. Notice these rocks right here. Now, and we'll zoom into this. First, you can't really see them, but check this out. There is an actual line there. Then you have this going down like this, so on and so forth. And you'll see that a little bit better in a moment. See that? Okay. Brighten it up a little bit. You can see where I brought up the parts that were already white and just made them brighter. See if we can't get these to literally pop a little bit more. So let's go over to the left, go down, Now, this object, again, is what caught my eye, and this part alone screams volumes. You can see what looks like a pipe sticking out right here. Just this object, the shape of this thing, is just absolutely cool. Okay? The details in this 
absolutely scream intelligently made. And of course, this thing still goes up like this here, and we got this wider piece right there. Whatever this thing is, again, screams intelligently made. These parts here I told you about, it almost looks like a mini boat, if you will. Let's zoom into that and have a closer look. You can see right here, this whole object. Okay. So something that almost appears round right here, but anyway, it looks like you can see these rectangular or square type openings. Kind of gets a little blurry here, you can't see it that well. But then look at the front, it kind of drops down. Right here, it looks like the front of the boat type thing. Now, I'm not saying that's what it is, folks. It just has that weird, uncanny look to it, right? Okay. Slide over to the left. Check this object or multiple objects out. Folks, look. Look at this. You look at these parts, they're ornate, and they expect us to believe that this is all natural. I don't believe that for a moment. Okay. Some other interesting shapes here. They black this out, and that's not the color of this thing at all. Notice the actual white pieces here, a tip of it right here. This has been blacked out. Look closely in here. You can see white inside that. So in other words, it's partially transparent, right? You got this right here. Is this just a circle or is this a hole going into the ground right here? Because that's what it looks like to me. It appears to have something going like this and then down into it. I don't know if you guys can see that. Watch this. Check that out right here. It looks like it's coming from in the back. Going down. Down. And it looks like it's going again into the circle. What do you guys make of that? Right? Okay, so let's back up a little bit here. At the very top of this, I see what looks like a junk pile. There's a whole bunch of junk sitting here. I'll just circle a few areas. This right here. Again, I said this piece that goes up and then comes over like this. And you can see what looks like a darker line of items or something there. You have something that looks like it's doing this. And of course, it's hidden behind this, whatever this is right here. I'm not sure what to make of that. That doesn't look like a real rock to me at all. Items up here. Look at this. Okay. You can see like bits and pieces of things that are not natural. All of this inside here. Check this out. Right inside here. What is going on with this area right there? It looks like different little holes and different pieces. See that? Now, if we slide over to the left to the mountain in the back, again, it looks like we're looking at some kind of parts. At least to me, in my opinion, it doesn't appear to be natural, right? Just look at the, some of the pieces in here, especially that piece right there. You see what it looks like it's doing this. Goes across here. Looks to have two like holes and something going inside them. Like that. You see something straight coming down over here. Folks, see that? Let me just zoom in a little bit. Put it right in the middle of the screen right there. See that? All right, let's go black and white. And let's go from right to left. You can see again this object in the middle of the screen. Right there. Small pieces. What is this? What are these pieces inside here? Some things that caught my eye. Like I said, all of this right here. All of this down here. Folks, up here it looks like a giant junk pile. It looks like stuff has been scattered all around. Like I said, all inside here. Got this piece right here. This 90 degree angle sitting right there. You can see it right there. Popping on the ground there. All these pieces in the back. What looks like these circles and shapes. 
to me, again, would scream intelligently made. I didn't mention this rock earlier, right here. The supposed rock. I'm not so sure that's a rock either. It looks like it had an opening, and something that actually opens and closes has been dressed up to look like a rock. You can see that. Go back to color. Notice it right there. What? And the way this thing is, it looks like it does this and goes down, and you can't really see it after that, but it looks like this thing opened and closed at one point, and it's been made to look like a rock. Not sure what's going on with that. This object in the back. And you can see it kind of like it does this. See that right there? Okay, made it a little brighter. You can see the difference. So anything that was white, we just brighten the areas up. Again, this object right here kind of looks like a boat that's buried in this hillside. Is it a boat? Mm, not so sure. Again, they don't give us a scale. And again, we have to the left of that right here. Okay? Folks, just weird stuff that to me is no way natural. Of course, you guys can give me your opinion on it and tell me what you think, as always, right? Just this area alone. I'm going to do this. Again, you've got the top right. This down here, almost in the middle of the photo, and we've got here lower left, okay? We'll do this in color and then black and white again. I think this is a really interesting photo, folks, to be honest with you. Really, really interesting. One last look at the top here. And there you go. Folks, when I seen this stuff, at first, hmm, okay, it looks like rocks. But just that object alone that's leaning to the side, it almost looks like a spacesuit that somebody wear, like an astronaut. It's kind of like in the ground and off to the right. It just stands out like a sore thumb, right? It just doesn't make sense. And then when you look at the other objects, they look ornate. It doesn't look natural. You can see what looks like designed lines with little slots in them, what look like little windows. It almost looks like a boat sitting in that hillside. Is it a boat? Who knows? It just has that uncanny look like one, right? Folks, this is just my opinion. I see what looks like a lot of junk, mechanical, intelligently made objects on this hillside. As always, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Please like and share the video. It's always appreciated. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so that YouTube will share it. Folks, like I said, there will be a Friday evening hangout at 4 p.m. Eastern time. If you're a new subscriber, join us. I think you'll like it. We have a lot of great talk on there. It's just fun group of people. Join us then. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.